Hello everyone, welcome back to Alistrius Panics that he thinks his controller's not working, but in fact the batteries weren't plugged in. Yep, this is a game we play with the good old controller. Oh look where we left ourselves. You know what? I'm gonna do it. It's about hello? Nah. That ain't moving. Well I mean if that thing behind there can't do it, I certainly flipping well can't. Let us learn about shields. We're gonna have to get some I think the idea here is that we need better shields in the first place before it's worth really bringing them along, but, you know, you've got to get in some practice of being able to return things and take no damage and stuff. Ooh, what do we win? What the heck? Did you see that? What am I supposed to do with that? <laughs> I can buy literally anything I want, and yet the majority of the time I don't want to buy anything. And now, the flipping... I can't take more than 600 gold back with me. Um, I guess we start... Let's do a survival run and see how it works. We've got to experiment. We can't just keep going through every single game, putting everything in red or maybe purple if we start off with a better bow than we do sword or something. You know? Nah, that's not going to work. What's this, a quick sword that we've got? The balance blade, yeah. Can we get it there? Yeah. I wouldn't mind an ice... Excuse me? That is not how that works. I've been advised to, when we go to the sewers, not take the uh, fast way down, but instead fall slowly and hug the wall. I'm going to do that. Did I need to do that? <laughs> it looks like there's a, a, a pipe. Parrying does do a certain amount of um, damage, it seems. That's straight to the toxic sewer. Wait, what? Are you telling me I couldn't have got to the sewers if I hadn't already picked up the thingy that lets me get to the sewers? The, 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 the room for the going the, down the place. I'm going to do some more exploring and not worry about the time door for now, even though there's a whole bunch of cells in there, because, you know, if we can find a decent shield from exploring properly and spending all this damn money that we seem to have accidentally picked up, there you go, you see, it's free. Um, yeah, I really need the gold to definitely make sure to sell everything. This is an unexpected turn up, and now I, I just... I'm spoiled by riches. I don't know what to do with myself. I never have to work another day in my life. Roll. Nice. That was uh, pretty effective. I'm hungry now. I forgot I was hungry. I've just finished playing Darkest Dungeon, but honestly, I got a little bit, not necessarily bored playing it two runs in a row, but like, it's <laughs> Darkest Dungeon, uh, Dead Cells is more enticing, so I'm here. I'm here for you guys. Let's just keep throwing this in survival and see how much HP we end up with. I suppose that has the same sort of diminishing returns as the other ones do, but... You know, we, we're gonna, gonna see, we're gonna find out. It's nice that those crush that. Uh, is this better? Might be. Let's never put anything in red. <laughs> Get rid of everything that's red, including our sword. We're going to go shield and bow now. I press shield. You can't stop me. going to kill everything. can't stop me. Is that the ramparts? Yeah. Uh, Premanamanad. Okay, fair enough. But, like, why is the top... There's money. I missed some money. Should I pick it up? Where's my shot, by the way? Oh, there's more. Haha! -ha. Be over here then, will it? Never you mind your time doors, I'm already a minute and a half late. There is a better shield. So, cool beans. Now, someone mentioned the cudgel is good. I didn't realise there was another one here. Crits, crits deal 20%. Stuns blocked enemies. Blocked attacks make the enemies... I really don't need the money. To the extent that I don't mind that I just... What did I just say? 
Who would I be if I didn't do what I... Uh, a man is no more than his word, okay? And I said that we might as well do a um, shield and bow run. And here I am doing a shield and bow run. I know it's an ice bow, not an infantry bow. So we're going to do this. Oh, there we go. Found it. Oh. I didn't realise it was uh, on a thing. So I <laughs> sort of assumed I was going to have to do a weird jump in midair. But we're, we've done it. Here we are. So apparently you have to just look again in order for it to show up the new thing that you gave. Successful parries and reflected shots inflict 159 damage. And what is this? Absorbs more damage, cannot parry. That's not much use. Absorbs more damage, and it's a force field for three seconds. Bow and endless quiver. I would mind a very much better bow than this. Well, we might as well start with this. Although I wouldn't... Tranquility might be a good one to have on the run like this because we're not going to be near enemies if you can avoid it. Pierce the first target is grand. Let's upgrade and reforge. Grenade, grenade, arrow. Yeah, keep that. Uh, nope. Nope. Yes. Pierce, good. Frozen, good. Right, I mean, we've got all this money. <laughs> More money than we know what to do with. We might as well... Spend it. Um, I don't know. Does anything improve these? I don't think so. I guess we just want after killing an enemy. We don't want the melee one, but we don't have anything that really... Nothing that really stands up to having a... I guess you call it a ranged... <laughs> a range build. It's a range survival melee. This is. I don't. I'm pretty sure I'm doing this wrong. Now, let me get that out there right now, so you can't all tell me off for doing it wrong. But I, I'm pretty sure I know I'm doing it wrong. This is horrible. <laughs> so we're not going to do very well without um, a sword. Well, I guess we've got our um, got these as well, right? Which is way better than everything else that we're doing. So let's do this, and then this, and then this. That's cool. That all seems to work as long as we just use one at a time. So let's just use one at a time. And remember that our primary weapon is the bow. Mushrooms? Any good? Mushrooms collected from all over the sewers. Grimoire. Research notebook. It's becoming increasingly difficult to collect mold samples in these sewers. There are too many revenants. That would be the name of the, uh, the dead things. The, the what we call zombies. They call them revenants. <laughs> it's not that grand. Um, however, that was nice. We can have this, and I'll just keep parrying anything that comes towards me. Except I won't because it didn't blink and work. I'm glad that that's more powerful than it needs to be. Because I certainly am not. Let me find... Okay, I, I take it back on the old sword thingy. But... Oh, come on. Didn't really give me much chance there. Gonna, uh, gonna, look, I'm practicing something I've never done before. And it's silly. And it's going to be difficult. Which is why I'm doing it. I see, I see the flash now. Thank you for informing me about the flash. I'm just splashing through these. I don't know if it's the correct way of doing it. That is so much better than anything that I've been using so far anyway. Also, hopefully this will train me to actually use my blinking skills once in a while, because most of the time I go through life forgetting I've gotten. I'm just gonna um No. Do that. Because I keep trying to shoot things and I've only got my Yeah, that's better. Now block is basically primary attack, but that's okay. Cool. Yeah. Interestingly, my uh, items are susceptible to poison. I'm not sure how you figure that one out, but there you go. Can't uh, fire your shield very 
Often. I'm realizing. Down, please. Oh! I didn't even expect to be there, so that's a bit rude. Can, can, go back and watch that video and watch me roll towards that shot, and then. Why did I end up in it? <laughs> what happened? That was really, really hard. I'm going to suggest that maybe. Um, also, that was a massive waste of all my money, but also, a bow and a shield is not a. Roll through it. Okay. A bow and a shield is not that great of a thing. So that's. Also, I hate throwing knives, so. <laughs> Pretty happy with using a shield again right now. Balance blade is definitely better than a bow in every situation, unless the bow is an infantry bow. And even then, that's going to be. Uh, nice. It's going to be. Um, facing the wrong way. Why are you facing the wrong way? Uh, the, it's going to be a, a red item, so. At some point, we're probably going to want to use tactics. Uh, not tactics, the other one. Wait, this is not a balanced blade. This is my favourite blade. Okay, I'm not. You can't. I'm not gonna. That's a very long cooldown on the shield. What is it? That's as fast as I can use it. And I don't have money to burn this time, so my embarrassment of riches is embarrassingly poor. Thank you for let's get survival and HP going because we want. Maybe I should have put the cells in the newly unlocked shield-based uh, mutation, but I didn't. So tough. Nothing over here to even send me back the way I came. That's so bothersome. It's a very rude game. Very rude of you. Not only did I come all this way on the uh, assumption that there would be something. But, which there wasn't, but at least if there was not going to be anything, you could have given me a quick way home. Anyway, it's only at 125. I do like critting things in a, a sensible fashion, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. I.e. I can, I can control the crits. It's not like I'm forced to crit by accident or something. Or like every third one. That's that's the weirdest one, I think. <clears throat> Especially since the rules is not literally every third one. It's every third one with a cooldown on when you last did one. Mm. So thirsty. I'm going to uh, maintain... What are you doing with that? Um, what was I saying? I don't know what I was going to say. Yeah, I don't really care about the uh, speed at which we get through these things, so I don't mind having a little bit of a a drinky who's a little bit of sustenance. It does do some damage, I like that. Even the most basic of shields does some damage if you parry with it. So I'm thinking, obviously the shield meta that I wouldn't really get the hang of before was that... Also, can I have one? A better one? No? Was that if you basically use it to parry whenever you can, it's going to do the damage to the enemies anyway. So now I'm thinking maybe if we can find grenades, that might be a better way. Not um, not green and purple, but green and red. Then we've got something as good as the Assassin's Blade here to get us through the main part of the DPS of the level. I was behind you, which is the way this entire thing works. And then we've got the shield to sort of, not necessarily fall back on, but it's almost that like we're falling back on the the red weapon there. And of course, I'm not using my, <laughs> um, I'm not using my um, skills because I'm a bad person who can't be trusted. Let's go to the toxic sewers again. I guess we don't need to find that thingy again. Oh, fine, I've got nine thousand. You know what, I don't... It may be better in DPS or, like... But it's situational. You have to be able to have a... You need a roof above your head, you know? Not everyone can afford that. So, in deference to people who are potentially sleeping rough or 
have otherwise managed to find themselves in an outside position. Um, a tent counts as a roof above your head, by the way. You know, if you luxur luxurious enough to, I guess, <laughs> downgrade yourself from house to tent. Um, at least you've got shelter. Is it still here? Yes. Thanks for being pesky. Oh, don't mind the money. I mean, that's standard, so there we go. Who found that? <laughs> Probably a better gamer than me who actually realises that the correct thing to do is... Um, oh, I don't want this one now, do I? Don't mind. Uh, is to look everywhere, all the time, for everything. Uh, I don't really want to burn all that money this time. So now we're going to go red and green. And I think that's probably better because the mutations that I like are improved by red, not green. Well, and green in this situation. Although, when you try and do a shield run, you don't get any good shields. Maybe the way to do that is that as we get through the game, what we're actually going to be doing, deciding what sort of run we're doing based on what good stuff shows up at the start, right? Nice. So, when we've actually unlocked decent shields to start with, there's nothing here. How do we get to that? Good flipping question. Nothing here. Nothing here. Must be through the bottom there. Fair enough. Once we've unlocked decent starting shields, then... You know, we can start to... Oh, that was just terrible timing. I actually got that one wrong, rather than you know, being ornery about the mechanics in the first place. Nice. Appreciate the cells. We're going to need that, because we've got a lot of things recently discovered. We now need to unlock. Really care about you jokers there, so... What? That was lucky, because I didn't intend to be there. Can you parry explosions? Please tell me you can. It almost seems like out of the spirit of the game if you can't just counter parry explosion. Counter parry, that's a good one. What? I appreciate that you can just shoot things back at the baddies. I guess we do want to go over there and see what that um, secret was as well. But we'll come back to it. Nice. So, reds and greens is our goal. And any decent shield would be nice. Look, I appreciate that. It's because we don't start with. Ah! Completely got that wrong. You can. I'm just going to try and win without using my sword. Okay. With mostly not using my sword. The reason I. Uh... Yeah, that ain't going to work. The reason I said, changed my mind a little bit there was because I realised that the majority of the damage I want to do is going to be with the shield, and of course I'm going to be testing things like, can you <laughs> parry the exploding flies? Um, I see the map telling me to go up here. See, now you're just troubling me. 18 seconds. It's barely worse than that, so let's get rid of that. I'm not using it. So we probably want to go with grenades rather than sinew slices and the like. Oh, I see you. Um, because, obviously, the whole point of having a melee weapon to finish you off, so to speak, is... You prefer burning enemies. Um, if my shield doesn't do the full job, I can always poke something with any old sword. But I want to get into the habit of doing the majority of damage with a parry. That didn't really work. Okay, so I'm glad that I have what I have, which is the backstabby thing. Um, but I'm also glad that I am putting some effort into, like, respecting my brain into using shields to do work rather than. Oh, I, didn't, I thought you were dead. My bad. My mistake. No. Now, where's this uh, secret? Can you see it over there? How do we get to that? Oh, probably. Let's keep exploring. We'll find it, don't worry. Oh, I see you. With a better shield, I'm assuming that would be a, a better attack. Yeah, we can do most of the damage with this and then... 
put less into the, um, the sword at the end of it. Although, this is an amazing sword and I love it. <laughs> so... A decent shield and this sword, and I think I understand the whole concept. Especially with the mutations that improve the shield to such a considerable degree. Nice. Uh, thought I'd roll past you. My mistake. So, um, probably going to need to heal and eat that kebab there, so we'll do that. Oh, I really want a kebab. I had a kebab last night, though. <laughs> That's the trouble. The things I want, I have had, and can't really justify a double. Oh. That was uh, not the correct time to try and use the shield to do everything. I'll tell you that for free. That's one of those ones where you just should learn to run away. Like I didn't in the Forgotten Sepulchre few episodes ago. Did I? Is this the way to that secret? That doesn't seem right. What are you doing here? Uh oh. Nice. What? <laughs> Excuse me? Oh, this is a new one. Inflammable oil and burn. Sure. Go that. Okie dokie. Get out of here and shoot this. Stop it. Okay. Do that. Good. That's more like it. Actually use the tools of the game to perform the you know, necessities of the game. <coughs> more brutality is fine. I know we've got a purple skill, but eh, am I even using it? Negative. Maybe the there's a lot of floor. In in that gap to the right of the to the left of the shop and below that area is where that secret was, so I goodness knows how to get to it. I could see it, but I couldn't reach it. Why are you sending me? Why is everything so far away? Roll past it and stab it. Perfect. Uh. Let's get this and this out. Oh, you hit me. Didn't expect that. No, I tried to shield, but I just haven't got the timing down, dudes. I haven't got the timing down. One more go. It's 22 minutes. 23 minutes. And I'm still thirsty. Let me have more drink. Mm -hmm. The last time I tried. Yes. Trying. Oh, good. Uh, I mean, I don't like the whips either, to be honest. Okay, fine. Um, basically, we have a long way to go. Which is to say, there's a lot of things to unlock that are going to make the game a lot more variable when we have done, but currently I want to unlock. I'm just not getting enough cells. I'm not saying that, like, the game is unbalanced around cells, I'm just saying that, like, I'm not getting far enough through the game to put enough cells into the to everything. So I'm going to go with Brutality for now, because Brutality and Survival is probably what we need to get through a, a run like the previous. Whoa, hello. Sure, Bernie Victims. That was an amazing lucky... Uh, I'm used to rolling past him to stab him in the back, but I guess I don't need to. Um, that's an amazingly lucky payout from that. It's a very strong shield, uh, very strong sword already. Oh, I should have um, collected that back. Obviously, it seems, well, obviously, it seems to me that let's, let's get this time door. Why not? It seems to me that Ranged enemies are best uh, attacked with a shield. I don't really care about that money, so let's just go. What can we put in? Successful powers reflect 120 damage. Yeah, it turned out that <laughs> um, long range shield meta was not very good. I don't want to reforge those modifiers. Let's upgrade this. Why the heck not? Shoots an arrow. Plus 20% damage, sure. And again, I'm going to take this combo because it's going to be a... I don't need it. Well done me. It's going to be... Um, a, it's a red mutation, so it's going to improve with what we're doing anyway. 
Um, feel a little bit like I'm rushing, which is probably fine. I mean, I've got a full minute to get along here. And, oh, okay, it's down here then. Suit yourself. But, like, is there anything good in here? Maybe. <laughs> Not really. Unless we can find a, um, a shop with decent items in it. Obviously, we need two skills and a better shield. Any of which could have been knocking around in the previous floor, but I was there. I thought we just So trying to parry some things is not the best way of going about it, I think. I believe the term we use for that is uh, meta, which I've been saying a lot, and of course, as soon as I actually mean it, I, I don't use the word. Nice. Occasionally, a stomp kills a whole bunch of stuff, and occasionally, it lands you in... Uh, in the juice. There you go, you see? What goes around comes around. Just as I was saying it. Give me a good shield and I'll start using it. But this sword is already outrageous. Kind of hoping for a cell or two. I think, you know, if you start off with a really decent item... you got... Ah! I... Okay. I planned that whole next step based on the fact that I'll be up there. And as soon as I wasn't up there, oh, 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 oh. that's not the way it goes. Wow. I, I just pressed Y on the off chance that it would do the right thing. I've forgotten that I was using a shield. Nevertheless, I used to parry a thing. Maybe there's more of a um, sort of a safe... Ah, what's happening? Ah, that was me. Maybe there's more of a, a sort of a safe zone in the parry than I thought that was. You know, a bit of tolerance. That wasn't enough tolerance. Ooh, yes. I just rolled at the wrong time there, to be fair. Yep. I'm learning, okay? Leave me alone. Trying to trying to find the sweet spot where you can parry but still like have enough. Um, what am I saying? Like, I want to be able to parry, but I want it to be enough um, opportunity that everything that is about to attack me run away. Come, right? That stunned you. That's nice. I mean, I kind of need HP at this point, so I think we're going to have to go for this. It does help with the shield, which we are going to try and make work. Help. Let's do this properly. Don't I tried to stomp, but I sort of fumbled it. It's, I'm not really reacting very well to trying to do something enough with bollocks. Failing to do it. <laughs> okay, nothing to say. This is the cheesiest thing I've ever done. That worked really well. Just give me this amulet. Poison's enemies that wound you. Okay. I didn't really mean to go in there. I was kind of on autopilot, so I'm glad that it worked out to be an archer. Just something I could actually fight. Because um, I haven't actually found any skills. Oh, yeah, great. Fun. No. Fan flipping tastic, mate. I would like. More. HP, HP, and I would also like more any skills at all, but more of them, and a shield. Basically, I have oh, there's can't get it. Nice. Run. Yeah, we can't get it. Okay. Thank you for <laughs> cock blocking me on the. Uh, Thinking I had a chance and then not giving me one sort of deal. There is a shop. No, it's an actual treasure. Okay, cool. A free one as well. What have you given me? I mean, this is so good. And it's a survival weapon. Can't sell that. So if we do manage to find a shield that works for us, we can uh, come back to the survival thingy. Let's go over there. I need to find some stuff. Anything that's valuable at all at this stage of the game is going to be good for me. You know, I'm. I was on the ground. What are you talking about? So, 
I, I'm keeping the crossbow for now because it actually has value. Why? Delilah. And then if we find something better, like a shield that I can actually use to do more than nothing to my baddies. I will go with it, but the value of this crossbow right now is reasonably high, in my opinion. Plus, I've not really been using the shield because my sword is so good. I guess I don't really need the crossbow either, but it's nice to be able to do damage from a distance. Run. Nice. That one didn't explode. Just using the sword like this is... Okay. I don't need to go in there. <laughs> Ow. Is that thing going to follow me? Did it die? What? I think it died. This sword is so good. I'm not worrying about, like, the majority of things that I normally worry about. Like, enemies that are about to shoot. Because they just die before they can attack. The, the massive difference between... Hello? Some contaminated bodies leaked into the drainage lines. And that must have contaminated the whole water network. But was the water contaminated before the first citizens fell in? Hmm. Which came first? The chicken or the egg? The one is in the black, but the one is in the red. One, two, one, two. Mississippi. Okay. We have got nothing I desire. Very well. <laughs> I'm glad we found the shop. Thank you for that. Uh, sure. I don't have a second skill, and I did ask for one. Now we're fully kitted out. The only thing that is not, like, ideal in this whole situation right now is that our, our, um, second skill hasn't got any synergy with our, um, with the, with the things that we're taking, i.e. Oh my god, I forgot. <laughs> oh, come back. Oh, I didn't want it anyway. My point is that the crossbow matic is purple and we're going red and green. I probably wouldn't have taken that, um, that thing anyway, that grenade, but I would have liked the option instead of accidentally using the thingy and then taking damage. We should heal. I don't know where we're going, so... Can we get past this? No? Right then. Run. Nice. What is this new amulet? I didn't turn too much, actually. Didn't hurt too much. Uh, I prefer that. Can we sell this? That's a lot of gold. I appreciate that. Like, as I was saying about this sword, as soon as anything looks like it's about to attack me, I just hit it, and then it can't attack me anymore. Which is basically all I could ever ask for in a sword. Ramparts? There isn't even a teleporter to get back. Where I would like to go to the ancient sewers. I'm going to have to navigate my way past all that nonsense. Alright, fine. Alright, fine. That's a new one. Not having a teleporter right next to the exit. At least I got a decent um, upgrade on my amulet. Which is a surprise, because rarely we get more than one amulet in the, in the game anyway. I'm ready for the ancient sewers. I mean, I haven't done too well on these sewers, but I think that it's, that's me. It's not my equipment. This isn't a bad run. I've got um, a ranged weapon, which is not that good at actual range. Is there anything down here, then? No. Uh, a ranged weapon that's not that good at actual range. I'm talking to you. There we go. And a uh, melee weapon that use, is colourless, which is great. Reforged modifiers. More ammo. Shots pierce? I think we can get better. The burning, yes. Uh, shots pierce. Poisoned. Pierce is fine on that. Um, toxic. That might be good. I quite like the toxic cloud thingy. Now we're actually getting into the fray, so we can take a melee thing as well. Um, so if I can just sort of focus a little bit more, which isn't helping that I'm like, hungry right now. It's far. It's very far. I don't like it being far. Then 
Maybe we can get through the ancient sewers and actually get something good done. I've done it before. It's just that you weren't here to watch. Of course, this is the third run, so now it's a nice long episode because I can't just play well from the beginning. No, no. I have to play well after sort of two rounds of warm-up. I forgot that our smash does the, um, does the damages. Run away. Okay, that is going to be probably the thing that kills me like it was last time, so do watch out for that. Oh, I see. I would like this to be some HP. It is, so you have to remember about that. I think in a fairly long ago episode, I completely forgot that there was a kebab nearby, and I just sort of kept going. Could have gone back for the kebab. Ran out of Estus Flask thingy. No. And, um... That's just not funny. <laughs> I hate when that happens. Look how much damage it does to you. It's not even fair. And there's nothing to hit. If you start hitting stuff after you've taken damage, you take less damage. It's sort of an adrenaline sort of mechanic. It's the same. A two plus is as good as a four. That's insane. Unless it's like not equivalent. It just always does that much damage. Stop. That's not a nice... See, sometimes it's just a combination of enemies. <laughs> it's not a nice place to put that other enemy, basically. Um, I think these two together actually work really well, because you can trap them in it and then crush them. And, of course, this one uh, scales with green, which is what we're using, so... Probably a good idea to have taken that. And it's also probably a good idea to actually start using the skills. Because historically, I forget, as you well know. And they could be pretty good for us right now. Run! No! God damn it. Uh, I didn't realise I was going to be off the edge, which is what happened there. Why? Oh yeah, it was one of them. So... I got stunned because I thought I was going to be able to hit that thing in the sky, and I couldn't. I really need to get out of there, believe it or not. Um, so you need to do this, and then I need to do this, and then this. And then I do this, and then you stop doing that, it's really annoying. <laughs> and then I can finally get rid of this. Now that the, uh... Yeah, I think that was the right thing to take that crusher because it completely eradicated that very annoying mushroom. Just pay more attention, man. I mean, that was probably not the right way to handle all that, but it worked, you know? It wasn't like I was finding myself, oh my god, I'm going to die. I just moved away. I couldn't roll twice fast enough for that not to hurt me. Um, I, I was just... Yeah, it was just the, um, I had to get out of there in order to not die horribly, but. You know, that was okay. I managed it. And every now and then I'm actually remembering to put my skills down so I can get something done. Why? <laughs> I didn't think I could hit them from the side. Like, as a human, not as a character. Thank you for this. This is a bit of a difficult one. Probably more HP because we've used both heals already. And we're going to have to go back for that. Um, that kebab if it happens again. The thing is I'm finding that um, well, what's really happening is that every mistake is very costly. That was good. Keep stabbing when that thing dies. That's the only trick. Oh, I'm not going to follow you if you're not going to follow me. Also, getting those mushrooms to attack a surface that you're not going to be on for very long seems to be a decent tactic as well. Where are we going? This way? There's one down here, I think. A mushroom. Don't actually need it. That's good. Wait, what's healing me? Something's healing me. Excuse me? 
I've got 100% damage taken on this blood sword and I didn't even notice. And I'm still alive. <laughs> what? I should have reforged that ages ago. Because everything is just dying anyway. Don't really need that. Um, run. Again. Nice. Whew. She is that one up good and proper well then. No. Good. What have you got here? I mean, I'm not using the heavy crossbow. <laughs> I'm just stabbing everything. So. Uh, we want to go and get the kebab that was down here somewhere. It was on the ground. Eat. What if I can use this? I don't think we want this, but you can sell it. Ah, get out of it! Exploding remains is good, but I've got a basically a full green build right now. In fact, now I think about it, the only benefit to putting anything in survival, uh, into brutality, is those mutations I've got. Can I parry the shield charge? That's my next question. Now, I'm not really going to use this shield charge. Uh, this. Uh, hello. Oh. I was going to say, what do I do? Where are you? Uh, probably not going to use the shield very much because I haven't been practicing with it all this time. But... Ow. Get out of it. Run away. <laughs> uh, what did we win? Sadism. We found that before and lost it because we died like a fool. I just want to get out of here now. If that's alright with you. And uh, go and reforge the modifiers that I hadn't realised I had. I mean, our DPS is really good. 12% and 15% is not that much, you know, different. So, I think we want to boost our damage with the, uh, the, the mutations that we've got more so than we care to um, improve the damage with literally everything else that we have. Which may be a bit short-sighted, but we don't want to test things out. Now. Right, okay. Oh! Just leave that there, and then everything else will come. Nice. I do like... <laughs> I wish they would explode a little bit quicker. I do like um, letting those things be killed by their own hubris. No. Uh, just leaving that thing. Of course, you have to be close to that thing for it to activate, which kind of still you know, puts you in range of the... Um... Yes. Why? <laughs> I'm just rolling for speed. It puts you in range of the stabbies, but... You can keep moving away from those. You, actually, yes. Because we are going to go and find... Also, there's more floor over here that I hadn't realised I hadn't visited. Less of that, though. That was okay. I mean, if you just bite, bite the bull by the horn and... Um, just get in there and stab the hell out of the mushroom. It doesn't do that much damage to you. It's only when you try and sort of pussyfoot around and try and dodge all the spikes and all that nonsense. That's when it really does you in because you're not. You know, it's not what you're here for, <laughs> basically. Just get in there and stab it, and it hasn't got time, as with everything else. Is that it? Yeah, just a place for the baddies and no special wall kebabs. Well, oh, I'm going the wrong way. Fine. That was a waste of my time and everybody else's. It's alright, we're all here for the long haul. Did you uh, aggro? I don't think so. Where is it? Over here, through here? Do I need it right now? I mean, I've come all this way. Might as well have it. I did. I needed it, and then some. 15% HP is kind of hard to gauge from the from the old lines here. Oh, I've got his 
literal number that I could figure out 15% of, but that's okay. Should we go up from here? There's a lot to explore. What is a boy to do? Everything just dies from all the uh, fire, which is absolutely fantastic. I don't want any of this. Can you believe it? I'm really not using my shield, as I said, I probably wouldn't. It's just the sword's too good. <laughs> the sword can do no wrong. It's probably something down here, like a treasure or something, because it kind of looks like a dead end. Called it. Oh, I do like it. Do I want it? Use his enemies for you. No, no, no. Maybe? I think we'll do shields later, even though this is a perp. Um, just the utility of a freezing thing is... Is that much better than a shield? Because I can't really use a shield if I'm constantly getting in with this stupendous sword and killing everything anyway with fire and stuff, right? This is a time to not be here, even though what I said about the... Uh, the thingy still holds. Nice. Keep, keep going. There we go. Where does this go? Please be in the exit. Do I want that? No. Insufferable crypt. Versus not leaving. Yes, let's do it. We made it through. Only at 46 minutes on the episode and I'm still thirsty. Oisky, poisky. Alright, here it goes. Uh, I mean, I know that this is for purposes of shield, which we're now no longer using, but we have at least unlocked sadism, which is amazing. So let's put more things into that. Grand. Okie dokie. I don't like this. No. No. Yes. Maybe. That'll do. I mean, the burning was nice, but it's not the end of the world. This is actually good because this is causing bleeding and this is damaging things that we've stabbed. And that causes bleeding, bleeding, so I think we just keep those. What have you got for me? I don't really need these. We might as well have efficiency so that you can use them a lot. I think that's really the only option here. Okay, good. Let's try it. I mean, oh, I fully expect that we'll die on this floor just because I don't really know what I'm doing. And uh, it is this boss that I've never, never faced before. It's conjunctive. I'm pretty sure that's a conjunctivitis, but it could have just said conjunctivitis. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. But... Get down. Get in the area of effect of my... Gosh darn. Good. Of my flipping. Oh. Uh, yeah, those. More? Don't like these. I find these. Day of the Tentacle all over again. Like these are exactly the tentacles from Day of the Tentacle. You don't even get to pretend they're not. No, you, you don't get to pop up because you, you're uh, not saying it's the mason mark. So that's what popping up. Why are you eating the door? It's not helping anybody with you eating the door nonsense. Come on through the fire. Ooh. Genuinely didn't expect that I would be able to do that, but here we are. Roll through that. It does have a much longer thingy than I gave it credit for. You are right. You are not wrong. No, no time. I wish bosses gave me a little bit more time to actually heal. That would be nice. These fighters are not helping. This is my opportunity to take it. Come on. 
not good. Bad dodge. You don't really go where I want you to go, do you? You just do what you like. Just that. Ow. And uh, very slow progress on this particular boss, I'll be honest. I don't know how to avoid this, so I'm just going to get hit by it all. That seems fair. Gonna get captured by that or what? I rolled and it worked. <laughs> Almost never happened. Ow. Come on. What are you doing up there though? That's my why are you doing up there? Help. Help. Just take it. I'm dodging like it's Isaac. It's not Isaac. That dodge worked as well. It's amazing. Stab it. <laughs> Why would you not? Well done. I'm the same size as those fires, I'm realizing. Can I have fought the uh, easier boss first, though? That would have been nice. Getting back into the swing of things, you know? Move. Just do <laughs> as much bleed damage as you possibly can. Just pointing out, this is the first time I've ever fought this boss. It's not the first time I've seen it. But, you know, there's a lot to be said for having some idea about, like, knowing what it's going to do and actually achieving the correct countermeasures to that is two completely different things. Ow. This is hard. Because these things move quickly. No. I'm not going to survive this fight if this keeps happening. Although, these are very nice indeed. Help me through the... Uh... Watching out for these um, tentacles is not the easiest thing in the world, I'm being honest. Get out of the way, also slow. Good. It's got actually a really big area of effect, and you can see it. It's not just the uh, zone of control, but the sort of the powder puff thingy in front of it. I would be dead by now if I hadn't have uh, given up the effects on that sword already. No! These are too hard to dodge! <laughs> I don't know how to dodge them. Oh, I really don't know how to dodge those. I guess the idea is you don't fail that hard, but we died, but we got to a brand new thing that I've never seen before. So thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this episode. Remember to leave a, a like on the old video there and subscribe if you haven't already and share with your friends if you have any. And until the next time, thank you for watching and I'll see you.